Hi, we're gonna build a fusion. Here's the kit as it arrives in the mail. And we're gonna open it up and see what's inside. So First I'm off, Tommy. I'm Tommy. This is Scott. I'm gonna step off camera and watch and you'll hear me asking Scott some questions, so. Okay, let's open her up. We're gonna build it step by step, just as you would if you ordered it at home. Now, we've already ordered this and we've ordered accessories with it, correct? Yep. So, it comes shipped. We got a hat. That was what I was waiting for. Epoxy, 5-minute epoxy. This version comes with the RRC3 altimeter. Thin CA glue, which we're going to use to soak some of the parts and harden them. And this is the accelerator that sets the glue up. All right. We're just going to unwrap everything and get rid of all the packaging and make sure everything is in the box before we start. So, and there is a parts list in the box to check off, right? There is. It's in the uh, instruction book. On the airframe too. So you want to be really careful and make sure you got everything that's on the parts list. Here's our motor tubes, 29, 38, and 54. This is an airframe tube, it's the upper airframe, and it has couplers inside it. Here's the upper air, excuse me, the booster airframe. And this is slotted already for the fins and has a line drawn on it for the rail guides. Decals inside, full body wrap decal. Here's the Nomex heat shields. More packaging. Here's the altimeter bay section of tubing. Four inch plastic nose cone. Parachute and chop cord, the cam one, altimeter, and camera mount, which all the kits except for the Diablo include now. And there's the instruction book that has the fin alignment guide and miscellaneous small decals inside of it. And the laser cut wood parts, which is fins, centering rings. There's even a little keychain in there for you and all the adapter parts to build the motor adapters. Nice. So that's the entire kit. And we're going to go through the instructions step by step. And we're going to build and fly this rocket right before your very eyes. Nice. I'm looking forward to this one. Uh, now, I should order one and build along at home is what you're saying. Absolutely. FusionRocket.biz FusionRocket.biz, and uh, we have all of our kits on there, including the Fusion, four other designs. So if you're looking to get started in level one, level two, this is the this is the kit that's designed to do it for you. Speaking of getting started, is this the first rocket that you made? No. What was the first one that you made? The very first one was way back in the in the early '90s, the Rocket R and D. I did the Brutus was my first design. And then we did several other ones for Rocket R&D, the Iris. And then I started Binder Design, yeah, which was later sold and is still in operation with Mike Fisher out of Salem, Oregon. And he does the Excel and Excel Plus, which I designed years ago. Oh. And then the Fusion is kind of the upgraded version, newer version uh, of that same Brutus slash Fusion design, or uh, Excel design. And... Uh, it has built-in dual deployment, comes with the altimeter, comes with the Nomex heat shields and shot cord protectors. Everything that you'd normally have to buy extra is included with the kit. It's everything you need except for glue, and we sell that too. Nice. So at this point, um, you'd store all this back in your box until you're ready to start building. Correct. Um, 
it would be a good wise choice to get the parts list out of the book mm -hmm. and go through and make sure you have every part um, otherwise you need to if you're missing something like there's a chance of that not <laughs> I hand pack each of these kits personally I was gonna and say I know the guy that packs them so <laughs> mistakes can happen but not very often and yeah. if they do you just let us know and we'll fix yes. you right up there's the parts list that you can check all your parts against and some drawings to show you exactly what you should have in the box and uh, let us know if you have any questions